Oh boy, is this even gonna be a good video? I guess we'll see. Sewing. So basically, the synopsis is that I'm sewing stuff, like this pink cushion, um, and I have a sewing machine, which it's not mine, actually, it's my, it's my teacher's, but <laughs> I'm in a sewing class and I have to make projects throughout the entire semester. So I bought all this red fabric because I thought I was gonna make a pillow, something similar to this, just bigger, but that was too easy. So I can't do it. So now I have all this red fabric. I thought to myself, what can I make that could be red? The one thing that I do have that I can make, a crab. And that is exactly what I'm gonna be doing today. So during class, I sewed 18 of these tiny little claws. And you're asking, why, why did you sew 18? Well, um, I wanted to make two for my sister and her best friend. And then I thought to myself, hey, wait a minute. I think I might want one of these because these things are so dang cute to look at. So. I made 18 because they're supposed to have six legs per crab. I thought that I had all this red fabric so I could make crabs. Turns out I don't think I have enough fabric to make all these crabs because I have to do three shells and six pincers. Pincers? I don't know. Pincers. Um, using just this one piece of fabric, which is a 21 by 21. Can I do that? God knows. This is probably a really bad idea for a video, but whatever. We'll just do it. It's not like I have anything else better to do. And with that, I begun my task of making crabs. You know, I should probably mention that um, this is like my first time sewing. So you might be wondering to yourself, well, are you any good? Well, I've made three projects so far and all of them turned out fine. And they also happen to be super easy things that are easy to stitch. And they all, they're all like straight stitch um, whatevers, and I don't really have to worry too much about how, you know, the sewing job looks like. Because it's hidden on the inside, and it's what's on the outside that matters. <sighs> this was a terrible tangent. But what I'm trying to say is, is that on the surface, am I good at sewing? Yes, I am. But when it comes to things like these, where I'm just like, hey, I have all this red fabric, and the only thing I can make with it are crabs. I don't actually think I'm good. I don't actually know what I'm doing. That looks about right, who knows. <sighs> we have one. Big meaty claws. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> so, I'm almost done with the claws. Um, and I was thinking, did I bite off more than I could chew? Well, great question. See, the only logical explanation as for why I'm doing this um, is not only so I could get points for my class because I need to be sewing, but I have an ungodly amount of red fabric and the, o <laughs> the only way that I could use it is for crabs because crabs are the only red animals alive. Crabs are the only red animals alive. Now you might be asking yourself, well, wh is this too much? Is three crabs too much crab? And to that I say no. I then moved on to the actual sewing, which was when most of the chaos ensued. I don't know how loud this is gonna be on the microphone. I, I hope this isn't loud. No, no. No! This is just a lot of me finagling because I don't know what I'm doing. That was bad. How do I undo? I can't undo. Oh no! Sneep snort. But we can work with this. If I just backstitch there. <laughs> oh no! I stabbed through the fabric. <laughs> <laughs> this is fine. 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 And then I'm gonna have to turn this inside out, which is gonna be kind of hard, because I 
sewed that really close to this one. We have a really big thing to pull out too. Mm, rephrase. It's a small, I have a really small opening here. I didn't really leave enough space. I have a lot of fabric to pull through, so yeah. <laughs> I feel like someone's gonna get mad at me for doing exactly what I'm doing. And that's just gonna have to be fine. It's a learning experience. It just so happens to be that I'm terrible at learning. No! Oh! No! No, no, no! Backwards, backwards! We're just gonna... We're gonna go over it. Hello? Hello? Ooh, that's not good. After sewing the legs and claws, I went ahead and stuffed them, which led me to the final step. Sewing everything together. Okay, so we're back. It's a little bit later, um, because I stuffed the legs. I stuffed the claws. The lighting looks really gross. Sorry about that. Um, but I'm not gonna follow the template for this. I'm just gonna do what I think is right. And those were my famous last words as I proceeded to do everything wrong. I don't know if this is right. Oh, boy howdy, this is gonna be a real funky looking crab. That's a crab if I've ever seen one. It's like a, an empanada. This is bad timing. Okay, moment of truth. We're gonna see if this actually looks like a crab because right now it does not. And after an ungodly amount of time flipping it inside out, it kind of looks like a crab. That's a crab. Bro, I didn't expect it to look this good. What? Look at that! That's wild. I'm gonna go do the other ones now <laughs> before I go stuff. And that was a decision I went on to regret as I got so frustrated. I'm so frustrated. I had to take a break to sew some scrunchies because of how stressed I got. I'm so stressed out! I ended up making seven. But I picked up where I left off and finished all of the crabs, stuffing and sewing them shut, and finally, finally, my journey came to a close. Look at these boys. These big meaty claws. <laughs> I actually really like how these guys turned out. Um, surprisingly, not too terrible. Um, I thought I'd completely mess it up and honest to God, uh, you can still see some of the stitching, but it's uh, supposed to be inside, but it's whatever, they're crabs. And I'm turning this in for my project, so, um, <laughs> yeah, it's just gonna be like that. They're just gonna be like that. A couple of crappy boys. <laughs> Thanks for joining me on this journey, and, um, yeah, uh, let me know what you guys want to see next because this was so dumb and whatever. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care.